checking out. Uh, in Seattle, our partial eclipse begins at 8 o'clock in the morning, around 8.07. It, it becomes 81% uh, covered. So what's gonna happen here at, at 920 is on a clear sky day, this is what it would look like. So we're still gonna see kind of a sliver of the sun. It's not gonna be like a total blackout, like uh, what we saw a few years back down in Oregon, which was spectacular. And even down in where we are getting uh, the, the uh, moon kind of covering the sun, there's gonna be a ring of fire this go around. And that's because the moon is at a different distance. It's actually closer to the sun. When it's closer to Earth, it uh, can block out the sun completely. Then we get totality is what it's called, and day turns to night. Then the partial eclipse will end at 1039. Here's the problem with this eclipse this, this uh, time of year is that we are going to get a lot of cloud cover, and I don't think we're going to have a really good opportunity to see this solar eclipse. There may be some spots that do, but for the majority of the Pacific Northwest, unfortunately, it's looking pretty cloudy as we get into your Saturday.